Greetings, I'm Hardleg Joe, if in you didn't know, and today I'm here on behalf of Leaf Blady to show you how to add his custom cards into EDO Pro. First, you'll need to download the file linked in the description. It's called config.json, and it's extremely tiny, only about 3 kilobytes. Next, you'll want to open the folder that contains all the EDO Pro files. There's many ways to do this, but the fastest is to right-click the game icon, and then go to the option that says, Open File Location. From there, you'll want to locate the folder marked Config. If your files are sorted by name, it should be the one right at the top. Now inside, you'll notice there's already a file called configs.json. This thing controls just about everything to do with the game, so you don't want to just delete it. LeafBlady's version should replace all its functionality, but just in case, you want to put the original version somewhere safe. In my case, I literally made a new folder, named it safe, and moved the file there. Now that you've backed up the original config, you can take the version you just downloaded and replace it. If you ever find that this game isn't running well, or the card art isn't displaying correctly, you can always just delete Leaf Blady's version and copy the original file back where it belongs. And with that, you should be good! To see the custom cards in deck building, just make sure you click the Alternate Formats box. This should allow you to search custom cards just like any other card. If you only want to search custom cards, you can also go up to the top right where it says Limit and select Custom at the very bottom. This should filter out everything except for custom cards. Now it's worth noting here that you can't play with custom cards on the regular Edo Pro servers. If you actually want to duel with these, you and your opponent will have to set up a LAN duel, which is a bit more complicated. In order to do that, you'll first need to set up a virtual network. To do that, I'll be using Zero Tier because it's what Leaf Blady recommends. You can find the link for it in the description or on Google by simply searching Zero Tier. The first thing you'll want to do once you've found the website is download and install the program. Then you'll want to sign up and make an account with Zero Tier. Once you're logged in with Zero Tier, you should get a page that looks something like this. Click Create a network, and then once one appears, click on the Network ID. This page will give you all the information about your new virtual network. In order for you and your opponent to play each other, you'll both have to be connected to the same network ID. So go ahead and highlight that ID and copy it. To actually connect to the network, you'll need to open the Zero Tier program. The program itself is very minimalist, in fact it doesn't even have a full interface. It just appears as an icon in the bottom right corner of your screen that looks something like this. Right click the icon and then click the option that says join new network. This should pop open a little window asking you to enter your 16 digit network ID. This is where you paste the ID code that you just copied earlier. Once you do that, Hit Join. If your computer is like mine, a Windows notification will pop up asking if you want to join a network. Hit Yes. Next, you'll need to send this same code to your opponent and have them do the same thing on their end. Once you're both connected, you'll need to go back to the web page where you're managing your network and make sure that both players are authorized. To do this, scroll down to the Members tab. In my case, there's only one address here, which is me. You should see two addresses though, you and your opponent. To authorize them, just click the box on the far left so that there's a blue check mark there. Once you and your opponent are both authorized, you should be able to land duel on EDO Pro with ease. Just click on the LAN plus AI option in the main screen and refresh until you see your opponent. From there, it should be just like any other duel. And there you go, how to get custom cards on EDO Pro and use them to duel against your friends. If you have any other comments or questions, feel free to leave them in the description. I'm sure Leaf Lady will be happy to troubleshoot any problems you have. Thanks for watching, and until next time, 
Good luck and have fun.